Hello, welcome back. DJ Vic Vapor with you. So we've looked at the piano roll and editing within the piano roll and understanding the functions there. Let's take a look at score editing. So when we click on the score button, we now have sheet music available to us. And within this arrangement, we can drag and move notes as we see fit and pretty much follow any score that's on paper if we want to duplicate or write that or if you're you know in depth at writing music on um, on paper you can certainly go in here and just kind of write it right in it's whatever your uh, comfort level is when you're working in any project score editing gives you basically the uh, paper arrangement let's an open let's open up the inspector and see a little bit further details so not only can we drag move and change notes within the uh, editor here but we can actually go over here in the inspector and include additional notes just drag and drop additional notes and write you can compose and write a complete entire score here you've got several different options to choose from on your bar here I mean it gets really really in depth so if you are good at writing sheet music or if that's something you prefer you have that option available in the score editor also let's say you've now I've written probably garbage I'm not even gonna play it but let's say we've written something that we really really enjoy and it's something we like you can also print this information and share it with um, maybe a, a musician that you want to have compose or or play this live for you so a way to print that would be to go up here to file down to print and we've got our options here and I'm not going to actually print it you can select different um, file types here. I'm just going to leave it as a PDF file and I'm going to ask it to uh, save to the de desktop. And that way I'll just show you kind of what it what it prints out as. So, PDF second here let's see print save as PDF actually hit the print button and fired up the printer on that one so save as PDF we'll tell you it to uh, tutorial test and let's say we'll save it. We don't want to deal with Ableton. We're in Logic Pro. Let's save it to the desktop. Save. Let's go over to the desktop here and see what we've got for it. So here it is right here. If we open this guy up and there's our sheet music that we could present to a musician. And you can have a complete song composed, arranged, written right there for you. And that is score editing in Logic Pro. Let's move on to the next lesson.